Hello and welcome to Inside Stuff. You're with me, Salil Why? We go into the inside world of what you probably haven't read, but you really want to know. We're talking about Tube Light. After Bahubali, I think the entire mathematics has changed as to how big a film can have a release or how much money it can make, plus how many screens can actually come in. With Salman Khan and Amir Khan, Dangal has also changed that. Sultan, although it was a limited release because it was Yashraj, still had a wide number of screens. But now, all over India, more than 9,000 screens will have Tube Light. Secondly, one of the primary uh, partners, as far as the multiplex chain is concerned, is running about 94 to 96% of theatres, screens, running only tube light. Now, that's never happened before. So, essentially speaking, this is the last week that you'll see any old films, and no Hollywood film will also be making its debut in the Indian market because there'll be no screens left. So, essentially, regional film market is just about 4 or 5%. Based on that, even that screen count has been given to Salman Khan. So, massive, massive screen count expected. They're also looking to expand in America. Salman's uh, fan base is very large. And this is also a first for Salman Khan. Will not be sure yet whether he's releasing in China, even though there's a Chinese actress in there. But because China releases only 36 films a year, it has to figure out whether they can actually release it there. Now, although Dangal did release in 9,000 screens, Bahubali is only getting 4,000 screens in China. But Taiwan, Japan, Korea and China, this entire Asian market is sort of opened up and Salman Khan and Tube Light would probably be looking to make Salman's first Indo slash other Asian countries release, which has never happened before and at the same time. So Salman Khan looking to make some big numbers, initial estimates say 100 crore weekend, very easy on the cards, especially with Eid on the Monday and 350 plus crores, even if it's an above average film, it doesn't have to be a brilliant film. That's the kind of screen count that he has. Seriously expecting this to break Dangal for sure. But maybe even challenge Bahubali if the film turns out to be a great film.